Here are the list of celebrities who are also reservists in the armed forces of the Philippines. Ding Dong Dantes Year 2006 when Ding Dong Dantes trained to be a Marine Reservist and renewed his enlistment in the year 2017. At that time, he holds the rank of Master Sergeant. But just recently, the Capuso actor has been promoted from the rank of Master Sergeant to Lieutenant Commander of the Philippine Navy. It was his wife, Capuso actress Marian Rivera, who was with him at the donning of the rank ceremony at the Philippine Navy headquarters. Ayon kay Ding Dong Dantes, sharing with you an excerpt of my message during yesterday's morning callers at the Philippine Navy headquarters. Hindi lang sa pagiging sundalo o kasapi ng unipermadong hanay na susukat ang pagmamahal sa bayan at pagtulong sa kapwa. Mateo Gritschelli Mateo Gritschelli is officially a second lieutenant of the Philippine Army after President Rodrigo Duterte signed Gritschelli's papers allowing the actor to move up from being a probationary second lieutenant. April 2019 when Mateo joined the Philippine Army as a reservist. Mateo finished the 30-day Scout Ranger Orientation and Leadership Development course with PMA Class of 2021 at Camp Texan in San Miguel, Bulacan. Mateo was the first civilian to graduate from Army Scout Ranger Training. Gritschelli also received a special recognition, a letter of commendation, and a Scout Ranger replica for obtaining the highest grade of 95.20% among 97 students in the class. Sarah Hieronimo was present during the donning of the rank ceremony at the Philippine Army Headquarters in Taguig. He said, I officially joined the Philippine Army today because I love my country. It is beyond the uniform. It is all about willingness to serve the country and being prepared for any eventuality. Gerald Anderson In the middle of his ghosting scandal with her ex-girlfriend Bea Alonzo, Gerald officially joined the army as a reservist after completing a three-day military training course. The Capamilia actor completed a soldier skills orientation training in Camp Texan, San Miguel, Bulacan, which makes him part of the Philippine Army Reserve Force. Binahagi naman ni Gerald Anderson ang naranasan itong hirap sa pagtitraining. Ayon pa sa kanya, three days of the hardest training I have undergone. EJ Falcon Airman EJ Falcon is a Philippine Air Force Reservist. He joined the basic citizen military training of the 1st Air Reserve Center under the Air Force Reserve Command of the Philippine Air Force, making him as an Air Force Reservist. Ayon naman kay E.J. Falcon, May kaya pa pala akong gawin bukod sa pag-aartista. Kaya ko palang masigitan ang kahulugan at kakayahan ko bilang mamamayang Pilipino. Mas makakatulong ako sa ating bayan, lalo na sa panahon ng krisis sa kona at kalamidad. Nash Aguas like Gerald Anderson, Nash also completed a soldier skills orientation training in Camp Texan, San Miguel, Bulacan. After completing the three-day military training course, Nash took to his social media to air his thoughts and his training experience. Binahagi din ni Nash Aguas ang hirap na naranasan ito sa tatlong araw na pagtitraining. Ayon pa sa kanya, Mahirap is an understatement to describe training both physically and mentally. Just like Gerald Anderson and Nash Aguas, Kapamilya stars Elmo Magalona, Eves Flores, and Jerome Ponce also finished the three days military training in preparation for their teleserie, The Soldier's Heart.
Ronnie Liang. Ronnie Liang also ranks as a second lieutenant in the Philippine Army. After becoming a pilot, Ronnie Liang also is now serving the Philippine Army. The singer actor finished his military training last February 2020. Apart from taking the mechanized infantry operations training to gain more knowledge about being a service, Ronnie also took courses on battle drills, armored vehicle defensive driving, and raid mission training. Ronnie Liang said, I volunteered to join the Army Reserve to support the armed forces of the Philippines and to serve my country. It was a humbling and life-changing experience. It made me love my country more. Rocco Nasino Capuso actor Rocco Nasino was enlisted as Petty Officer 3rd Class in the Reserve Force after graduating in the basic citizen military training conducted last year. He is currently assigned at Naval Forces Reserve National Capital Region under Naval Reserve Center. Rocco Nasino said, got to experience the prestigious donning of ranks at the Navy headquarters. This has ignited a feeling of greater love for my country as our officers take time to recognize our efforts in serving our country. Bilang sumumpa sila na pagsilbihan ang bansang Pilipinas, lalo na sa panahon ngayon na may COVID-19 pandemic, ay ginawa nila ang kanilang tungkulin at tumulong sa mga taong lubos na naapektuhan sa nasabing virus. Una na dito si Dingdong Dantes. Nakaisip ang kapuso actor na gumawa ng delivery service app na layuning tumulong sa mga small businesses at sa mga taong nawala ng hanap buhay dahil sa COVID-19. Ang may bahay naman ni Dingdong na si Marion Rivera ay ilang beses nang pinagluto ang mga frontliners at si Dingdong mismo ang nagde-deliver nito. Si Matei Gritzeli naman sa tulong ng Landers Philippines ay nagkaroon ng fundraising at nakalikom ng 4 million pesos. Ito ay para mabigyan ng mga relief goods ang mga pamilyang higit na nangangailangan at naapektuhan ng dahil sa COVID-19 lockdown. Si Ronnie Liang naman ay sumugod mismo sa kalsada at tumulong sa Philippine Army upang maiwasan ang pagkalat ng COVID-19. Sa mga checkpoints, naka-assign si Ronnie Liang. Si Gerald Anderson naman ay napiling tulungan ang mga frontliners. Nagpatayo si Gerald ng quarantine tent sa iba't ibang hospital. Layunin nito na tulungan ang mga COVID patients lalo na dahil overcrowded na ang mga hospital ngayon. Ang mga quarantine tents din ay para sa mga doktor at nurses na kinakailangang ma-quarantine.